Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to explain you one of the most important concept called picture in picture view. So, how to achieve this picture in picture view in Flutter? I will give you detailed information about this one. Don't skip the video, please try to watch entire video. Otherwise, you are unable to understand. So, first of all, we have to use this package by enabling the picture in picture view in Flutter. So by using this package, we will able to enable the picture in picture view and we will able to close the picture in picture view mode. Both properties uh, we are having inside this library. So first of all you have to go to the installing, here copy this one, open the android studio, go to the PubSpy camel file, here paste here, ok. So after that, do flutter pubget. Okay, done. So now go to the main dot here. Take one stateful widget, my home page. My home page. After that, instead of container, take scaffold widget. Inside the scaffold, add body. Inside the body, I am adding the column widget. Inside the column, I am taking one two widgets. One is the start pip mode. Elevated button. Okay. Now here you add on press. Now give the child as a text. Open. Pip mode. Give some margin here. All twenty. After that, take one more container. Here, close. Pip mode. Okay. Now here. Inside open pip mode on press uh, picture in picture view. Okay, picture in picture dot start pip. Here we have to pass pip widget. Okay, so inside this one. We are having one callback function. So here I am giving my name Hussein. Okay. So here in pip widget we are having two properties. One is on pip close, second will be the child, child text. So whatever the child we are giving, that child will come inside the pip view. So whenever the pip view is closed, this callback function will be called. And here we are having few more properties. Elevation, elevation giving 10. Uh, border radius also there, pip border radius. Uh, giving uh, 20 okay and okay these properties we are having so all properties we added here okay here inside this close pip mode I am closing the pip window so what I have to do just picture and picture picture and picture dot stop pip mode Stop. That's it. Or uh, this pip view will be stop. So let's start run the code and check how it is coming. Flutter run minus d chrome.
okay so if we see here here two buttons is came open pip mode close pip mode so when i click on open pip mode one view will come one overlay window will come see see like this this is the pip view picture in picture view but i am giving the text as the hussein so it is coming top left but i want in center what i have to do just go here go here wrap the text inside the center that's it now i'm clicking on open pip mode see my name is coming inside the center okay so here we will able to move the card also see wherever we want we will able to move the card so i want to close this pip view what i have to do just to, we have to click on this close pip mode that's it open pip mode close pip mode open pip mode close pip mode okay so and also here for example inside this uh, pip view we have to give some specific height and specific width uh, then and also we have to give some space between top left bottom left uh, um, top right those things also we will be able to do inside this library so how to do just to open this package here we are having update pip params so by using this property we will be able to do the changes here so what you have to do so when you are opening the pip mode now when you are starting the pip mode before that we have to write this properties here max size minimum size remove this one here i am giving 144 pip window height will be i am giving 100 okay this will be 100 height and width will be 100 but the bottom space left space added movable will be true because i want movable if you want to give false then it will not be move resizable as uh, false initial corner will be bottom right okay so i need uh, top left otherwise bottom left i am adding bottom left so initially the view will come bottom left so let's run this code and check how it is coming so when i clicking on this open pip mode see here it is coming okay if you see the size of the width and height also decreased so whatever size we added 100 and 100 it is coming exactly and it also movable okay so like this we will able to achieve the pip mode in flutter so this library uh, helps in both web and uh, mobile also if you take any android or ios both places it will be work both places it will be work so this is the complete information about this one uh, if you like the video please give a like if you are not yet subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel and you will get more upcoming videos like this and share to your friends this video might be helpful to them thank you